The automotive industry is a very important economic force in the United States as well as in countries throughout the world. The horseless carriage had its inception in Europe in 1863, but it remained for American mechanics, engineers, inventors, and businessmen to change the motor car from an expensive toy into a working machine for the average person. This was accomplished by building cars in volume, by mass production methods, and by passing the resulting savings on to buyers. American Motors is a pioneer in the automotive industry, dating back to the establishment of the Thomas B. Jeffrey Company in 1902. The 1902 Rambler was one of the world's very first mass-produced cars with 1,500 sold that first year. Mr. Charles W. Nash purchased the Jeffrey Company in 1916. He then formed the Nash Motor Company. In 1937, a merger with Kelvinator Appliance Company formed the Nash Kelvinator Corporation. The economy car was introduced in 1950 and was given the name of Rambler, revived from the early Jeffrey days. In 1954, a merger with Hudson formed American Motors Corporation. Nash and Hudson nameplates were later dropped and production was concentrated on 100 and 108 inch wheelbase Ramblers. A compact car revolution was underway and by 1960 all U.S. auto manufacturers offered compact models. Now, many auto industry contributions were made by American Motors and its forerunner companies, such as the rear deck to carry luggage and spare tire, the fifth wheel to make tire changing easier, first sedan and coach type bodies, first counterweighted crankshaft, rubber mounted engines to absorb engine vibration, fresh air heating and ventilating systems, low cost air conditioning, and the first to offer seat belts. American Motors pioneered single unit construction, reclining, and individually adjustable front seats, adjustable headrest, aluminum window frames, curved glass side windows, deep dip rust proofing, and the double safety brake system on United States cars. American Motors purchased the Kaiser Jeep Corporation from Kaiser Industries in 1970. Famous for its line of four-wheel drive utility vehicles, its history dates back to the famed stagecoach builders, Overland. As one of the largest manufacturing corporations in America, with annual sales of more than $2.6 billion, American Motors employs about 28,000 people worldwide with 18 plants in the United States and Canada and 23 manufacturing assembly plants and licensees outside the U.S. and Canada. Among other company facilities in Wisconsin is the National Parts Distribution Center in Milwaukee, a body plant in Kenosha's lakefront plant, a proving grounds west of Kenosha near Burlington, and our main automotive manufacturing and assembly plant in Kenosha, which contains engine manufacturing and assembly, stamping and body manufacturing and assembly of American Motors automobiles and one of the largest assembly lines in the industry. Corporate headquarters are in the American Center, a 25-story office tower located in Southfield, Michigan, the Technical Center, Amtech, housing product development, research, styling, and related activities is located in Detroit, Michigan. Plastic components are produced by Everett Products, a wholly owned subsidiary, as is Holmes Foundry, Windsor Plastics, Mercury Plastics, and Wheelhorse Products. Electrical wire harnesses are produced in Coleman, Wisconsin and Iron River, Michigan. Our manufacturing and assembly plant in Brampton, Ontario has produced Jeep vehicles as well as passenger cars. The Jeep Corporation is located in Toledo, Ohio. AM General, with plants in Indiana, is the largest producer of postal delivery and tactical wheel vehicles in the world and is a leader in the production of electric-powered vehicles. 
American Motors signed an agreement in 1979 with Renault, the French car and truck manufacturer, which includes automotive sales activities in the United States, Canada, and parts of Europe and South America. A new family of Renault cars will be built at the Kenosha plant starting in 1982.